Well, I have a pimple there. That's unsightly. That's alright, though, because I am a man. And speaking of being a man... Come on. Come on, Nick Diaz. What are you doing, bro? Point... Nine... Tenths of a pound... Beat you up? You want it to be ruled a no contest? How about that? Bottom line... Rule it a no contest, have a rematch, and get fucking owned again. Until I saw Nate Diaz versus Bendo, I really thought that Diaz had a uh, ooh, excuse me, a good chance of winning. And you know, probably would have submitted um GSP. But uh it's becoming rapidly, rapidly more and more apparent and it will be only only more apparent when Bendo beats the shit out of Gil Melendez, who I remember his fight against uh, Josh Thompson, was it? They're saying he's the best heavyweight of all time, best heavyweight ever. What? Gil Melendez sucks. I'm sure he beat me up, but I mean, in comparison to the rest of the lightweights in the world and in the UFC alone, he Sucks balls. Pettis, own him. Joe Luazon, own him. Jamie Varner, own him. Melvin Gillard would probably own him if he's on one of his A-game days. Jim Miller would probably outwork him too. You know, and I'm not just naming only, you know, like top five guys. Just the top ten, top fifteen in the UFC will fucking destroy Gil Melendez. And we're all going to see that happen. Back to what I was saying. The entire Caesar Gracie camp, except for Nate Diaz, he's good. He needs to, Nate Diaz, you need to go find a new camp far away from all those fucking clowns and buffoons. His name doesn't even start with an R, Caesar. He is like the, la and the other, the Gracies don't even really acknowledge him. He's the laughing stock of the family, and it shows. Just give the fuck up. And now all this about, the, Caesar Gracie was saying that GSP was one step ahead of Nick, Nick Diaz, like he had somebody, an insider, watching him train, and these fucking Diaz fans are eating it up. Yeah, that might have been it. Yeah. Oh. First it was, oh, he just cuddled. No, he didn't cuddle him out. He fucked him up, plain and simple, the whole time. And Diaz was only trying two or three escapes, which are simple rolls. GSP is a superior wrestler. All he did was hop from either side of him. It looked like me getting beat up by one of my wrestling coach. It was it was pathetic. And now they're trying to say that because the Canadian Commission doesn't count decimals in the UFC rule, point nine tenths of a pound. So you know what? Throw it out. Make it an oak contest. Have a rematch. Aggravate the little Frenchman again. French Canadian, whatever. And get wailed on some more. Just stop it. Save a shred of dignity. Every time you fucking lose, you're gonna retire, and I don't know, and... Ah. Uh, God, I'm glad I'm not a fan anymore, because... Fuck. How about man up? What happened to... Oh, nobody trains harder than me. Uh, if I came in trained in the post-fight... before Pre-fight? Nobody trains as hard as me. He can't box with me. I'm with the best boxers. Ah, blah, blah, blah. After the fight, uh, well, you got boxed silly with a jab, a simple jab. The first, the number one, the one first thing you learn in fucking boxing should be the most avoidable punch by a lesser boxer, GSP, apparently. And, you know, it, it's, it, it's, hold on to a shred of dignity and just give this shit up. Too much fucking crying and whining. It's gone from, like, bad boy persona to, like, fucking bad girls club. Shut the fuck up. Please. I feel bad for you. Really. You, like, you're making a fool out of yourself. You're a fucking great fighter. You just need to stop bullshitting and beat some people up. Train harder. You and Nate should both go. Go to Team Quest or something. Get your wrestling skills up. 
or you know, go to Henzo or Ricardo Almeida, somebody who knows fucking real jujitsu. Cause it, no, no. And now with this lawyer and all this, it's just. This is some WWE silly. This is some baby mama shit. That's what that is. Well, I'm taking you to court. Stop. It's a bad look for yourself, for the sport. Just stop it, please. <sighs> Make me fucking sick. <laughs>